半端がないマジやめろやめろやめろやめろやめろやめろやめろやめろこれだけわかんておいおいやめろやめろやめろやめろほんまやめろやめろはい、ほっぺろうん。あんまんがのしょうゆ。あなたポンチョセットペアム。あ、ペンマイナウ、グレートブリッドのモーマン。いつはホットアスエヴァビンオンレコード。そ、あんがのポットポンチョアップ。あんがのポットリッジラインアップ。あんがのポットポンチョアップ、あんがのエイフレームファッション。あんがのしょうゆ。あ、クイック、アンイージー、シンプルウェイ。Of getting airflow through your shelter, through your poncho shelter. If the weather changes, it's just too quick releases of stakes, and you've got shelter again from the elements. But it's brilliant for hot weather climates where you need airflow to go through your, your poncho. Now, taking into consideration, first, of course, is the wind direction. There's no wind at the moment, but I know it's due to come from a southeasterly, okay? Southwesterly, sorry. Coming through. So the back of the of the of the A-frame will be facing the wind that's doing. Let's get it started. So what we're gonna need for this exercise? One poncho, one ridge line, four toggles. Two tent stakes, one top clip. I might be able to get away with not using that, and another hunk of paracord. So there you go. I've just set up an A-frame shelter. I'm giving a hood a that tree there. Now the wind is push, going to be pushing this way. So obviously you've got the back of the poncho facing the direction of the wind. So during a hot day, we want the airflow to go through. So this is what we're going to do now. So what I've done here now is, I've tried tied a loop there ready for a prasic knot okay so i've tied a fisherman's knot and tighten up together and what i've done i've left a long tail and i've put a figure of eight loop knot on that end so i'm gonna put that in my top pocket now ready for the next phase so there's my loop to make a prasic knot and there's my figure of eight loop knot on the other end So it's a prasic knot with a long tail. So what we need to do here, taking our end pegs, stakes, take them out and just bring them in six inches. Same on both sides. And just bringing it in six inches so what we got now is so what we got now is we got slack there look so as you can see all this is slack so all I'm gonna do Put my prosec on. Once. Twice.
in the net. I'm stressing it up a bit there, I'm guys. Twice should do it. So I'm just stressing it up. So you guys slide in. Classic knot, okay? So what I'm going to do now is take in the tail here and put in a loop up through the grommet. Put the toggle through. I'm moving my plastic knot out for the tension. So what you got now is guys. You got airflow. Don't forget now, the wind is pushing this way. So you got nice airflow there. How easy is that? This is a tricky part. Making a long tail on a prasic. But once you grasp that, you're away. So at the front now of the pond show. As you can see, I got airflow through the back. Easy peasy, Japanese. So that's all you do then when the weather's about to change. Take the toggle out, put the pegs right down. Like so. So just like how we backed out A-frame. And protect it from the weather. Like so. Right then guys, I'm going to have a brew now, a cup of beef tea, and then I'm out of here. Uh, I hope you liked that little video guys. I say it's uh, the only tricky part is putting a long tail on your plastic knot. But you'll get there, as I keep saying, practice, practice, practice at home or at work. When you're sitting in the car waiting for the missus to come out to pre-mark, you know the crack guys. Carry your anchor cord around there, okay? Comments down below, thumbs up, and if you like what you're seeing and you haven't already, give us a subscribe, guys. We most appreciate it. Channel's moving forward now. Uh, I don't know when the next giveaway is, but um, I'm guessing when we're on 1500, okay, guys? So keep your eye out for that. See you on the next one, guys. Over and out. Subscribe and like this video, and nobody gets hurt.